think going into this World Cup in terms of England, I think one of the really interesting factors um, is how Roy Hodgson will approach the forward situation with his strikers, not just which system he play, but which individuals will slot into that system. Um, because it's, it, it's quite important to, to know not just how you're playing, but which players fit in certain positions, which players can actually cope with playing out of position. For me, there's one thing that, that should be pretty permanent, um, given fitness and form, and that's that Daniel Sturridge plays up front in the middle. Um, I think from time to time in different systems, Roy's used him on one side or the other and had uh, Wayne Rooney up front in the middle. But I think Sturridge gives us different options. He gives us a threat behind the opposition's defence, which I think is, is really important. That's something that Wayne Rooney doesn't do so frequently. He's very good at coming off, of course, creating space, um, turning, hitting shots, bringing other people into the game, working hard. But in terms of a threat behind the opposition's defence, um, that's Sturridge's territory. He's very good at that. And what that does, of course, it makes the opposition slightly nervous. So they edge a little bit further back, which creates space between the opposition's defence and their midfield uh, for others to exploit. And um, if we can do that, it makes teams think. Whereas if you've got a player that doesn't go that way, the opposition's defence can squeeze up and then you've got less space to actually perform in. So the question then, of course, is, is that Right, we've got storage up front, then who do we play and which system do we play? Well, you could, of course, play some sort of diamond in midfield, like Liverpool have done so successfully this season, and um, put, put Wayne Rooney in that natural position just behind Sturridge, the number 10, if you like. Um, or you could play 4-3-3, um, which has worked quite well on a number of occasions for Roy. He's used it very adeptly, and, um, and it's given the side a nice balance and a little bit of depth in your midfield, which is which is vital. Uh, if we play sort of two lines of four, two in the middle, we'll get outnumbered a little bit. Difficult. You tend to strikers get separated from the midfield. So hopefully he'll play some sort of system that gives him that depth in midfield. Um, but then you've got the conundrum, of course, is, is if Sturridge is up top in that system, where do you play Wayne Rooney? Well, Wayne can play anywhere. He can play on the right. He can play on the left. He could even play in, in perhaps the forward midfield role. Um, but the question is, of course, have you got better players um, in those particular positions than, than Wayne Rooney? You could, you've could, got all sorts of options, which is, which is great. You've got the possibility of Sterling playing on one side. You've got the possibility of, of possibly Lana playing on either side. Um, Welbeck, of course, it has been favoured a lot by uh, Roy Hodgson in his team. So you'd expect him to play probably on the left-hand side because he covers a lot of ground. So it'll be interesting to see which way Roy Hodgson goes or will he just sit back to that you know old we played four years ago in, against Italy two lines of four Rooney and then someone else up top um, so all sorts of possibilities and um, I can't wait to see which way he goes <laughs>